Honestly, I just love AI. Today, we can code with AI, and you can do it only with prompts. So whether you want to sell this online through, I don't know, maybe Fiverr, Upwork, whatever, or you just want to do this for yourself, you just have to talk to it in your natural language. It's called Windsurf, and a lot of people are comparing it to Cursor, but I'll just compare these two today, and I'll show you what Windsurf can do, and I'll show you what kind of money people make with these things. And it's so simple, right? Before you had like WordPress where you can just build a website with drag and drop features, but this is way better. You talk to it just like you would talk to Midjourney or whatever. Even more simpler than that because you don't have to get specific. First of all, just Google for it because I'm not affiliating for it. Just Google for Windsurf code editor like this. And it's gonna be this, the first result here. You're gonna land here where you will eventually have to make yourself an account and you will have to download this to your computer, right? Now, first of all, I wanna show you how this works with what ease this works. So if you just talk to it, right? If you put a command, let's just go with this command. So using React and Tailwind, make a button which changes color on hover, right? So this is all that you gotta do instead of writing all these lines of code. This is so good for anyone especially for people that don't want to spend a lot of time to learn how to code. I mean, that's dead, honestly. So this is how it looks like. Welcome to Windsurf. Click on Get Started. You can import your setup flows from Cursor, or you can just start fresh. I'm going to start fresh with this one. I'm going to use default key bindings from VS Code, and then you just have to select the theme type here. There are a few of these. I'll just use... Let's just use this one Tokyo night, whatever, or you can use this one. You know, there are a lot of these themes and I just like them. This one is for me. So click on the next button here, log in, and this is gonna be your workspace. To start, you're gonna have to click on file here and on new text file, it's gonna appear here. And of course, if you just wanna increase the size of it, you hold control and you click on the plus button, right? And here it is. And this is your best friend, this cascade here. This, as you can see, uses Claude. It can use Cascade Base or GPT 4.0. And this is where you talk to it. This is where you talk to it in your natural language. So whatever you intend to make, as you can see here, kick off a new project or make changes across your entire code base. So you can just start with it or you can edit your code that you already have. And all you gotta do is to write the prompts. So let's just begin with a simple homepage of something that's gonna be used for e-commerce, let's say. So this is what I did. I wrote this, make a homepage for an e-commerce website which sells clothes. And of course, it's just gonna respond. So I'll help you create a modern and responsive homepage for a clothing e-commerce website. I'll create a new project which with HTML, CSS, and some basic JavaScript to make it interactive. First, let me create a new project directory. It's gonna create all of it on its own, but firstly, it's gonna ask you whether you accept or not, click on accept, and then it's just gonna run it. So, first of all, we start with an index, HTML, of course, and just have a look at how much time this saves you. You would have to write all of this time, you would have to create the directory yourself. But with this, I can now just go and grab myself a coffee until it makes me a web page. And later on, I just have to edit the things that I don't like. Just imagine the possibilities for you to drop service when served to a lot of people out there. And also you can upsell things because if you sell the web page to someone or a web app, you can make web apps with this one as well. So if you sell it once, and let's say you build something for an e-commerce store with clouds, if they add new items, they will always call you again to bring those new items in there and of course pay you again for it. So here it is in the go. As you can see, it creates, first of all, now it's working on styles, it's working on JavaScript as well. And basically you don't have to do nothing, right? And it shows you what it does and it's giving you an update, what it uses in order to build all of this. Once in a while, it will ask you to review something, to accept or change. It's just good. And there you have it, the whole homepage. I did this, well, it did it in two minutes maximum, right? So this is really, really good. In two minutes, you get this. As you can see, to view the website, of course, you can open index in your web browser. It recommends setting up a local server to view it properly. 
would you like to me to start a local server for you to preview the website you can just go to good response and you can just type it in so start a local server let me just do it like this copy this clip this right me and yeah it's gonna do it for you once again accept the command here well i don't have python here but there's another way to check this but look at that it found a solution so i see that python is not installed let me try an alternative approach using node's http server package this is so good i wanted to show you this on replit but i can just open it here inside of web browser it's just good have a look at it i have a complete home page you know how much time it would take for me to make all of this and now you can just go watch at this result and then you add things on top of it right so that's how good this is it's really really good you have a search bar here you have a login you have a cart whatever home categories you go it doesn't have pages yet because I told it to make just home page but you have everything the button is also changing the color so it's really good so let's just play with it some more let's just go and write something like this so add another page inside men section and put some images as placeholders for some men products to sell and of course it's gonna run it right away what's really cool about this is that anybody can code nowadays and you don't have to spend a lot of time practicing you know you have to practice this is not going to be a get rich quick scheme or something you have to practice but you don't have to go to school anymore you don't have to complete courses you don't have to pay other people to teach you to do this all you can use is windsurf and then you can explore by yourself but of course the more hours you put into this well the faster you will be and more clients you're going to land and here it is fellas this is here in the categories it would go there this is men's collection it brings you the categories it brings you the size you've got everything laid out here three pages of this and it puts like placeholders for images add to cart buttons it gives you the price sections as well and it gives you of course the names for each one of these items it's just perfect right down there as well it's just good really really powerful this cuts down a lot of time for a lot of people now you can go over and you can change the names you can change the price for all of these you can change whatever you want inside of here if you want to do it manually or you can still talk to it if you think that this can do it faster some of these things it's better to do manually right but some of these things like the whole block of this one is going to be faster with cascade when it comes to the pricing though on windsurf here as you can see you have to pay only 15 dollars per month and this is just too good to be true right so you can spend 15 dollars when you compare it to cursor it's 20 dollars per month so it is less expensive than this one and if you have a look at some of the prices that people take for a web page it's just crazy for example let's just take i don't know this person this person has a lot of reviews so it is 86 and it is a simple job so i will do a web page design using html css basically whatever we did right now and it's 76 dollars for the basic basic one so three pages so 80 dollars. this one is 140 114 pardon me and you pay 15 dollars per month in order to use the tool it's just good now it'll just depend on you how much time you intend to invest in this and how much proficient you want to get out of this it still requires work you have to sit there you have to talk to it and you have to fix the things that your customer doesn't like and that's it so wish you good luck and catch you in the next one